Okay, we have here a diesel. A, it's pretty unclear here, 1K ZTE engine. It's a Toyota Hilux Surf. And we got it here on the IDIAC. I'll show you. Got it here. Stuff we can see. It's basically the same list as we get for the petrol. So on the diesel, it's it doesn't matter what scan tool unless you use the factory one. You're not gonna get much. We're gonna get quite a few things that are helpful. Like it's idling high, which I don't like. It's 80 degrees Celsius. I thought it might be a substituted value. It isn't. It went up. So it's not temperature sensor that makes it idle high. Maybe someone screwed around with the bolt here. Who knows? Since we're in New Zealand, anything is possible. But yeah, I'll have to ask the client. If he wants it changed or if he's happy having it idle at 1000. If the fuel consumption is fine, then it might be alright. But we'll go inside now. I'll show you what sort of data lists we're having on here when it's running. So we'll see. I'll focus you on here. Oh, I dropped out. This is, of course, the voltage drop from the starter killed our scan tool. That's why we have the other power supply thing, which might be connected. I don't know if we get in now. Yep, managed to get in. Nine hundred twenty-five speed. No, it's not. Yeah, it is live. So the ignition advance six degrees, one degrees. Throttle opening nineteen degrees, seventy-two degrees. Intake manifold pressure 30, 37 Airflow. 0.76 volts, that must be from the absolute manifold pressure sensor. So the sensors are all working. If one of them is lying, I don't know. Definitely seems strange since the air conditioner, turn the air conditioner on. On now. 975,000, it, it goes up a bit. So it's almost like someone's been fucking with that screw. Which I showed you before. I have to see, like, yeah. Turn it off. 75 RPM. On again. So it does raise the RPM. So, in theory, if there's nothing else wrong, apart from, of course, EGR problems, that remains to be inspected before we start messing with that screw. Or we leave it as, as that, if the client wants it, keep it like this. I'll be alright. Okay. That's basically all we get on a diesel here. Engine speed. Injector pulse. It's doing something there as well. Who knows what it is relating to. Because there is no measured injector pulse on. It's just translated from the uh, petrol version to the diesel. At least we get something. So... If we'd known that this is a known good one, we could use all this information on the next one. Okay, thank you.